This is a tutorial which shows how to add colors to Microsoft Word. So as you can see and are probably familiar with, in the colors for Microsoft Word, it's fairly limited. So if you have a particular brand color that you would like to implement into your document, it's probably not going to be here. So today I am going to show you how to do that. For some of you, you have a style guide which was provided to you by your graphic designer or someone who helped you with your logo colors. In this case, I have one from my client. Hex number, usually this is applied for different online tools. And RGB is also a web-based digital color. And this is what you want to remember when it comes to applying these colors to Microsoft Word. So in this case, I'm just going to take this particular color, this deep maroon, which is 964848. And the way that I would apply that to something like a heading is that I would just select the text and then click the arrow, which is right next to the color bar. Click on more colors. You'll notice here there's a drop down. So there's grayscale, slider, RGB color, CMYK, HSB. CMYK is for print colors, and sometimes you might have that on your style guide. In this case, this is a digital related thing. So I'm going to select RGB. And the colors that I saw on the style guide was 96, 48, 48. Go ahead and press OK, and it'll change it to that exact same color. Now, what you can do throughout your document is you can select all the text you'd like to be this color and keep on pressing this button. And sometimes something will come up here that says recent colors, and you can select it that way. Another way that you can retain that color, let's say you want this heading to always be that, you can select the exact heading that you just colored. And let's say you want to use this size over and over. You can go up here to the styles menu and you can create a style for that. I'm just going to call it, you can select any of these, but I'm going to call it book title. So what you do is go ahead and press control and click your mouse and press update to match selection. What that's going to do is memorize that color and that style. As you can see, it kind of changes here. So anytime I type in some text and I want it to be that style, it'll go ahead and change it to that. Now for these circles, I want it to be orange, but I want it to be the brand color of orange, not just a standard one from this menu over here. So I'm going to do the exact same thing where I look at the style guide. This orange is 2018525. So I'll go ahead and click back and just format the shape. So again, you're going to press control and click on your mouse and go over here. And the color that I want is 2018525. Go ahead and press OK. And as you can see, that's a darker orange. And now that I have that orange registered in my Microsoft Word, I can go ahead and select both of those format. And again, as mentioned before, recent colors, I can go ahead and select that. And let me make sure that's the right one just by hovering over. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and select the other two as well. Format object and select the most recent color. And there you go. I don't think there's a way for you to be able to save the style when it's applied to shapes. However, click on your formatted shapes and see if the color that you last use is there. And that was a tutorial of how you can apply and add colors to the Microsoft Word program. And if you have any other questions regarding Microsoft Word and using it to design or make things look in a particular way or style, go ahead and leave a comment below, leave a request. If you like this video, please press the thumbs up. And if you like my videos, subscribe. Thank you.